Not only does the Field and Test Engineering Scan Station provide the most accurate models of accident scenes, it can also provide an accurate three-dimensional model of damage to vehicles involved in an accident. These truck trailers were all that was left of a high-speed double-trailer big rig that careened into several vehicles in an intersection in Malibu. The Field and Test Engineering Scan Station accurately preserves all details of accident vehicles with an internal laser that captures and measures the exact location of every point. Visual models are created by the millions of points as it surveys, each with a unique and measurable three-coordinate location in what becomes the Survey Point Cloud, which is created and permanently stored while the instrument scans the accident vehicle and the scene. The three-dimensional models can be used as is for courtroom exhibits, or they can be imported into a CAD or reconstruction program to give you the most accurate momentum crash analysis possible, each point with a 3 mm median accuracy. These point clouds will also provide the most accurate measurements and geometric model for vehicle crush analysis. It would be virtually impossible to collect even a small portion of the millions of measurements of an accident scene or vehicle with any other survey or modeling method. The inside and outside of this metropolitan bus that struck a pedestrian crossing Market Street in busy downtown San Francisco was made to show the exact location of four video cameras that were installed in the bus which recorded the accident. The point cloud accurately depicted the path of the pedestrian and clearly showed what the bus driver could have seen as the pedestrian crossed in a crosswalk in front of the bus. As part of this model, Market Street in downtown San Francisco was scanned on a Saturday morning under heavy vehicle and pedestrian traffic. The sophisticated scan station software easily removes the vehicle and pedestrian traffic. And then, the bus point cloud model is imported into the scene to present a three-dimensional exhibit of the complete accident scene which can be viewed from any height or angle. The field and test engineering scan station can also be used to show the intricate geometry of a road surface. This point cloud model was able to depict the unique geometry of a dip in the roadway that caused several serious injury accidents when vehicles went out of control and ran off the road on this rural state highway. Then, the point cloud model, accurate in every geometric detail, was imported into PC Crash, a momentum-based accident reconstruction program, which accurately revealed the geometric features that caused these vehicles to run off the road and roll over in this virtual accident simulation. This point cloud survey was made at a highway rail crossing in Chatsworth, California. The emergency brakes on this train weren't applied until after the locomotive had struck the truck's trailer. The Field and Test Engineering Scan Station survey has the unique capability of being able to show the visual aspect from any point in the accident sequence once the survey is completed. Point of impact marks can be imported into the point cloud, which can be used for easy identification of the collision sequence. Then, an invisible camera can be positioned to fly through the point cloud using the exact position of the locomotive engineer's view of the accident sequence. The first mark on this point cloud shows the location of the first point of impact as the locomotive struck the truck's trailer. The three marks on the far side of the crossing show the impacts of the trailer as it swung into the other lanes and impacted two vehicles and a motorcycle. This entire scan survey model was made from outside the railroad right-of-way. This accident occurred when a railroad crossing gate came down between the big rig's cab and trailer as it was backing to deliver a load, severing its trailer's brake line, which locked the wheels of the trailer. The driver was attempting to pull the trailer clear of the crossing when it was struck by the locomotive. Once the point cloud fly-through was made, a highly accurate reconstruction simulation was also made, which showed that the train's emergency brakes were not applied until 56 feet after the collision 
even though the trailer could be seen for more than 1,200 feet from the cab of the locomotive before the impact accident occurred. Nighttime or twilight scenes are easily depicted by the Field and Test Engineering Scan Station. This is the fly-through point cloud of a serious injury pedestrian accident on Pacific Coast Highway in Laguna Beach. The detail in the scan was necessary to accurately define what the driver could see at the time of the accident. The lighting was also critical to provide the visual field of the driver. The ambient lighting was replicated by sophisticated camera equipment and used to complete the scene. As can be seen from the reconstruction simulation derived from the survey, the pedestrians were virtually hidden from view by opposing traffic when crossing in this uncontrolled crosswalk at the time of this accident. The field and test engineering scan station survey can even be made at night as was necessary in this Pacific Coast Highway site in Malibu because of the inaccessibility during the heavy daytime traffic. The survey is made using an internal laser which requires no light as it is reflected back to the recording device in our scan station instrument. This reconstruction simulates the accident that occurred when two bicyclists were forced into the heavily trafficked main road by a construction project ahead. Accident reconstruction simulations can be used to demonstrate human factors phenomena. A series of warning lights had been installed in the road just in front of this crosswalk prior to this accident. But because of improper installation, only one of the series of lights was still functioning at the time of this accident. Even though that light was removed prior to our survey, we reintroduced it into the simulation, which then clearly showed how the driver was distracted by the light as it flashed under the left turning cars ahead. A human factors phenomenon called focal blur occurs when your eyes focus tightly on a single point, such as the light under the turning cars, which can exclude the surroundings as is shown in this second simulation. This scanned survey point cloud follows the path of a Monterey County boar hunting ranch vehicle that was chasing boars and rolled over when their vehicle came upon a depressed road in front of them. The view of the driver was clearly portrayed in the point cloud fly-through. And when two separate accidents occurred less than a month apart at this rural intersection near Visalia, which resulted in seven deaths, the field and test engineering scan station point cloud was able to show that there were no visibility restrictions at the stop-controlled roadway. It was eventually found that neither of the two drivers had stopped before proceeding into the intersection. Field and test engineering can provide the most technologically advanced methods of analyzing your accident from the scan station laser survey to the most accurate and most admissible accident reconstruction simulations.